Hello, new here. Welcome back to more Mario Sunshine. Last time, we freaking took care of other people's chain chomp dogs, cleaned up freaking the village, the Pionda village from all that lava goop. And this time, we're about to head back in there and see what we could do. Now, before we head up there, do want to remind you to like, comment, and subscribe if you like what you see, and ring the bell if you want to be notified whenever I upload a video on your phone, tablet, and your computer. Also, check out the description. There's a bunch of playlists down there, a bunch of playlists down there of other games that I play that you might like. Now, last time, I freaking I said, uh, I said that yeah, there was a way to get up here without the rocket, and I was rewatching the last episode. I was like, oh yeah, there is a way. So the way to get up there without the rocket, if you wanted to like do this level first, a Bior, um, I mean before Bianca, Bianca Hills over there, what you gotta do is you have to. It's weird. So, so in the air you can't change your orientation. You can only like move. But, if you go into first person, you can change your orientation. So what you gotta do is, in the air, you gotta change your orientation, jump that way, go like this, turn that way, so that you hit this wall right here, and then do a wall jump. Whoa! Ugh. So you wanna do a wall jump off this wall right here. So I have done this before, not as a kid, but I've done this before, and it's not too bad. So, if I do this, that way, wall jump. Oh god! Oh, it's just like that, but s smoother. I can do this. Here we go. I can do this. Whoop! Oh. Huh? Oh. oh god! Oh! Oh, I need to be a little bit faster than that. Oh god! All right, here we go again. I can do this. I have done this before. No! I'm about. Oh, I'm about to run out of water too. Okay, face that way. Just want to go. Whoop! Oh! Okay. Yeah, yep. First person. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. Here we go. Yep. Like that. Turn around. Oh god. Oh, so close that time. Okay, I'm still up here. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna try this one more time, but then I'm gonna give up. Here we go. Yep. And. Oh no. Oh, wait. Is that it? Oh! All right, old-fashioned way. All right, first level of the day. We are going to undercover the secret of the village underside. Now this level, I believe uses Yoshi. Yep, look at that. There's the Yoshi egg that we know and love. So we gotta take Yoshi and bring him down there because there is cheese down there that we need to burn. So let's see what fruit Yoshi wants this time. Also, if you if you do like the little, hang on. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, oh god. Stop. Stop. Oh my god. If you do this on this bridge, it is like this right here, like dive jump like that. It is possible to fall straight through the bridge. I have done that multiple times as a kid, and now I try not to do that here. But it's just so fun to do this. Gosh dang. But Yoshi wants a coconut. Coconuts are right up here. All the fruit are up here, really. Let's just gotta hope that Yoshi does not want a durian, because that freaking sucks. Alright, let's see if we can do a trick shot here. Oh, hang on. You know what? Maybe we can. Hang on. If we could jump up here and throw Yoshi this coconut from up here, that would be sick. Ha! Hang on. Hang on. No, 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 no. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Ha! Yeah! Go! Oh, and well, that didn't work. Yoshi, I got your coconut. And we got Yoshi. Also, what, what's going on here? Howdy there, son. The entire village is ready for the annual Fluff Festival. Even us old folks start getting excited about this. <laughs> oh, and before I forget, I I am not the mayor. If you're looking for him, he's probably at the yellow mushroom. <laughs> anyway, yeah, that's why everybody's partying. They're having a good time. They're getting ready for the Fluff Festival, which I believe is going to be the eighth episode, the eighth level in this area. But you want to take Yoshi? We're going to skip all this and jump right down here because Yoshi does not take fall damage. So we do want to be careful here. No, no, no interesting. I mean, wait, I know, no, I can do it. No, no, 
No complicated parkour moves. We just need to get over here. Probably can land on this mushroom and get a one up right here. But here's the cheese. This is the cheese that we want to burn. Bah! And the cheese is gone. Let's go in there. Now this level, I think I think I remember this level. This level is where you need precision and aim. This level can be hard as heck, and it's also possible to fall through the floor over there where the star is. But I'm gonna play I'm planning on doing this first try. But here's the gimmick of this level. If you talk to this guy, hey, howdy, I'm a chuckster. You better be careful when speaking to powerful Piakas. Some will chuck you straight up, but most will chuck you backward. When it comes to talking folk, I went from a chuckster. Well, uh, well, I'm a chuck. Anyway, everybody's a chuckster here. So the thing about this level is we want to want to aim ourselves to be thrown that way. So. But depending on where you're standing, if I'm standing here, he's gonna throw me. He's gonna throw me into the void, the shadow realm. So I wanna, I wanna try to aim myself perfectly back there. I am a chuckster. <laughs> All right. So the baby one, we wanna talk to the the little baby one, even though he's got a mustache. This is a grown man right here. We wanna talk to this one because this one is stronger. This guy right here, if you talk to him, uh, I remember this. Talk to this guy. He's weak. You're gonna go into the void, even even if he's right at the edge. You talk to him, but this guy right here, we wanna talk to him like right about here. Oh god, no! I may be little, but I never gave up. Oh god, oh god, oh god! Oh, fine, yeah. And this guy, he throws us straight up, so we wanna talk to him right here. We do go in a little bit of a direction, higher, higher. Oh god! And here we are. Now these guys, these are gonna, they're gonna try to get us to, they're gonna try to throw us off our game here. But if we talk to this guy real quick, well, I'm a chuckster. Everybody's a chuckster these days. It's so popular. Now this guy, this is the hardest one. So we gotta get this guy. We gotta talk to him when he's like right here. I mean, it's, it is possible to get at an angle, but we see those little. Okay, there are little. Uh, there are two triangle pieces that like lead up to that little center square thing right there. It's kind of hard to tell you what I'm talking about, but it is possible to f go through the wall after being thrown here. So we do want to, I, I'm, I'm, I was going to say we need to be careful, but go! I'm a chuckster. Oh no, wait. Oh, I think I, oh, 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 right there. This corner is possible to fly through the wall, but just like that, we got our star. Next up we have, we have Piantas in need. We need to help these Piantas. I don't remember this level at all. What what's going on here? Oh, oh! I remember this. So basically, we want to save the Piantas, all of them, un under a set amount of time. Oh no! I just went away for a little bit, and now look! I can't believe it! Another fine mess! It's a doozy! Some of the villagers are trapped in that burning ooze. And I just finished evacuating everyone a, a little while back. What in the world's happening? I think I might just start crying. I'm sorry to trouble you this time after time, but please, please help my people. Time to help us again? Can you help us out again? Do you have time to do that? Ten villagers are trapped in the slime. Please hurry before they burn and die. Sure. So everybody's freaking, they drowned in, this, in the lava goop, and there are ten of them. So, we're gonna start over here. Look at this guy. What do you guys say? If you talk to somebody, time pauses. So, I love, I love the sunshine, but oh, is it ever so bright. Here, take these sunglasses. Uh, uh, anyway, oh gosh, dang, the screen's a little bit darker, but that's fine. If we can save everybody. Do they all give us blue coins? I don't think they do. No, they don't. They're not paying us for our, for our help. They just want to be saved. Hang on, wait for the animation, because when they the animation of them coming out oh god oh Ooh. the animation of them coming out like you can't really spray them what do you gotta say your child was in the lava <laughs> help my friends okay everybody's gonna, just gonna be saying the same thing here all right like this level is pretty straightforward that's one and that's two oh that's three, well, it's six, but you, you get what I mean. Oh, yeah. And I had a little bit of trouble finding this one, but that's it. 
And once we saved them all, we gotta talk to the mayor again. Hey there, I saved your people. Stop running away from me. Hey, stop it. I'm trying to talk. There we go. You're the savior of Pianta Village. We are in your debt. As a reward, please take this. Take this golden star worth one billion dollars. Maybe you should be the new mayor. Since you could actually help people and I can't. Oh, oh, also you look so cool with those sunglasses on. And now it is time for the very last required level in Mario Sunshine. Episode 7. Shadow Mario runs wild. Oh god, it's time to kill him once again. Now every every episode, every area, you have to do all the way up to level uh, episode 7. All the way up to the seventh level of each area. That's required. Episode H of e episode eight of each level is not required. They're just optional. You don't have to do it to f you don't have to do them to finish the game. But we're gonna do all of we're gonna do all. Oh dang! Oh, this is different. He has he has a oh god! He has a freaking lava trail now. So at least we can't lose him. But we we've completed every episode eight in all in all the other worlds, and we're not gonna stop here. So we are going to do episode 8 in this level as well. Oh, I remember this. Oh. Yep, and I will remember the fact that <laughs> I just got another billion dollars worth of this gold star. Heck, yeah. But that that's the last that's the since that's the last required. We've did episode 7 all the other worlds and this is the last one. Now, something, I, I think if I remember right, something special happens in Overworld here. Yes, there he is. He remembers this. Oh, God. What is he doing? He's in the water. He should be dead if he goes in the water. Since what is we? But yes, the volcano up there, we can go in there. But also, everything is flooded. Oh, gosh. Everything is flooded. What the heck is going on here? Oh no! Tell me, tell me, Mister. How did this happen? Why is everything flooded? Global warming. What the heck? I just went to the roof. Global warming is starting to affect our video games. The boats are still running even in these conditions. Amazing! What the heck? This guy right here is happy about it all? Gosh, what a spectacle! I'm just glad to be alive! <laughs> Where are the cameras? Where are the cameras? Where are all the cameras? Why is everybody happy? What the heck? Oh, this is the guy from the island! Well, I knew if I was lucky I could follow the current, and now here I am! This is the guy that was on that island, he, he was like living there for years or something. But, yeah, everybody's trying to stay alive like during the flood and whatever but uh hmm, oh the basket that was right here is gone uh but the thing oh hang on how do i get up there how, how do i get up there probably these umbrellas yup there we go right here the game wants us to go that way but <laughs> We haven't finished freaking Piata Village. We don't need to do this. Come on. We're gonna finish up Piata Village by doing the super parkour move. We can't get the rocket nozzle nozzle because it's under the water. But if I can I don't know if this will break the game or not. I, I wouldn't think so. But there we go. Oh I did it! Oh I did it! Let's go back in here and finish up Piata Village before we deal with this. Piata Village, episode 8. The Fluff, the Fluff Festival. Oh, let's just go to the... Before we deal with the flood crisis, let's just have a party. You know what I'm saying? Oh, every, oh everybody's having fun over here. Yes. I think there's a red... Is this a red coin level? I don't remember. I hope not. Let's see. I don't remember this level all that often because Pianta Village was always the last world I did, last area I did in this game. So I'm not sure exactly what I'm supposed to be doing here. Uh, wait, 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 where's the mayor? Is the mayor up by this mushroom again? What do you guys say? Oh, here's the mayor. Hey, you, careful. Even if you grab a piece of fluff, what are you going to do if you miss a cloud and, and fall? 
That sting. Okay, what do you guys say? What's going on here? I think I'll grab some fluff and float away myself, mom. Okay, I think what we gotta do is get to the top of this tree? I, I don't I don't really get what's going on here. There are no longer green mushrooms up there either. Not a one. All I saw was a red coin. Oh, this is a red coin mission. Okay, so all the red coins, it looks like they're gonna be... Looks like they're gonna be in the sky. Dang, I hate red coin missions. I, I always, I've always hated red coin missions. But let's try to do it. Let's see where the red coins are. Yeah! Oh, I can't reach up that, that high. Oh, yes, I can. It's gotta go right here. There's a mushroom right here. Uh, now I can probably get up high enough. There we go. Oh, no! No! It's fine. There we go. I made it up here. Uh, so... Yep, this is a red coin mission. All the red coins are probably gonna be higher up. So... Oh, God. Ooh, almost died right there. And also, they did hint that we can grab onto these fluffs. So, if we... I think the way to get this red coin is to get, get up there by jumping off this. Oh, no! 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 Hey! Perfect! Okay, I need to get this coin. There we go. Right there. Alright, that's one. You know what? I think... I don't think I ever did this level when I was a kid. Okay, but I do believe there's a red coin over on this tree, on that little platform right there. It would make sense, even though I can't see it now. I think there's one there. Uh, never mind. Huh. Maybe this is a red coin mission. We've got to get them in order. Oh, oh wait, hang on. There's one right down there. Oh! Gosh dang it. All right, back. Got this coin. Now the next coin is down there, right below that tree. The one that we saw, we're not going to die this time. Whoa, whoa, I just grabbed on that. We're not going to die this time. Yeah! Hey, there's one right here. Oh, God, hang on. Wait. Oh, God. Oh, the bees. Oh, the bees could actually knock me off and kill me. Okay. So let's go ahead and get rid of that beehive. And then run from the bees until they freaking despawn. Oh, God. They can't get me in the water, right? Same trick. Oh, they're gone. What? The beehive is back? Oh. Uh, okay, what if I just like... Oh, God. Oh, wait. You know what? What if I knock it down and then like circle around? Yeah, what if I knock it down, circle around, get it this way? Yeah. Next coin. There's one right there. Trying to disguise itself as a fruit. You're not a what the heck? You're not a fruit, little coin. You're a freaking coin. Oh, there's a blue coin in the grass. Oh, there's a red coin right there too. Hey, let's go ahead and get that. Now there is a red coin all the way over there, bottom right corner. There's a coin right over there. I do want to go ahead and try to get that. I don't know exactly how to get that, but I could try. Maybe it's down this way. What? Where is it? Oh, there it is. Oh, it's right there. Oh, here. Wait. Oh, yeah. Here we go. This is how you get it. Do this. Get here. Let that fall. And then we... Wait. How do we... How do we get on top? Okay, so there is a swing here. We were just over there, but if we can swing, we might be able to swing. Where are we trying to swing to? We could swing there, jump off, hover on top of this. That could be one way. That's a little risky, though. That might be the way. Oh, I just remembered I don't have the hover. I got the rocket, so I got to take a, a little bit of a risk here. Here we go. Go, go, go. Yes. Yeah. And that's coin number five. Ah, and there's a coin right there above these bees. Oh, wait a minute. Nope, not above the bees. It's on the leaf. Oh, what? Mushroom. So we can go ahead and get that by doing this. And there we go. That's coin number six. Oh, 
There's a coin freaking down here in the water, in the hot tub. Okay, that's coin number seven. And there's one more left. And the last one is within these boxes. So if we break them all, ah, we get our coin. That's the ver our very last shine sprite, minus the 100 coins. We're not doing 100 coins. So all we gotta do is make our way over there. Don't know how, but we'll make our way over there. Okay, star is right over there. So I think we can rocket jump from that big tree over there. All right, now this is a little bit risky. That's probably what this platform is for. We gotta, wait, what? Huh? Wait, where's the, oh, it's over there. Hang on. Oh, I really hope I don't need to grab onto these uh, f fluff things. I probably do. Oh, God, I do, don't I? Oh, no, okay. If I, if that's the case, I might need to grab onto this one. Grab onto that one. Come on, grab onto that one. Yes, okay, now I just gotta wait for the wind. The wind will blow and take me that way. Yes! No! Yeah! Yes! And that's how you get that star. That is all the missions in Mario Sunshine. And now we can deal with this flood problem. All right, Shadow Mario. Time to fight you and finish you off once and for all. Oh, ow! He punched me. Wait, what if I shoot him? Ah, oh, okay. I gotta go in there with him. But welcome to the true final level of the game. This is where Bowser Jr. has Peach captive. Now this level, once you die, you start all over. This is probably the hardest level, the real hardest level in the game. But, but ha, I've mastered the spin jump. So <laughs> it's not gonna be all that hard. <laughs> Heck yeah. Heck no, I mean. Okay. But, yes, when I was a kid, I had a lot of trouble with this level. Also, the f after, you burn, after you burn out the fire, it does come back. So, it is important to be a little bit quick here when you're jumping off these fire things. Oh, now here comes everybody's favorite section. The boat section. Anyway, no. This level, this part, this part of this level is awful. Uh, when I was a kid, I had the easiest time controlling it from the back, like this. But I feel like it might be a little bit easier to do it from the middle. Or, you know, yeah, because this crossing this lava path right here, we if we hit a freaking rock, it's over. We die. We gotta start all over. Oh god. Oh god. Wait a minute. No, not like this. Not like this. Not like this. That way? Nope. No, no, no. Yep, yep. Yeah, yeah. No. Oh god, my phone's making noise. Not at a moment like this. That way? Just a little bit. And go forward, forward, forward. Nope, nope, nope. Yeah, yeah. No. Even if we hit that, we can't hit anything. No. Get away from me. Ooh. We're almost there. It's gonna get to the point where I can just spin jump off of here. Okay, if I do that. Okay, I think we made it. I think we I think we can just basically just push forward here. Yep. And we're here. Okay, that wasn't so bad. And if we wanted to, we can go all around in a circle and get all these blue coins. Oh, so many blue coins. But we're not we're, we're not here to do 100 percent We're not here to 100 percent the game. We're here to finish the game. Finish the story. So once we get the rocket nozzle here, we want to jump into the clouds and jump up high, get up higher and higher. And if we mess up, we fall all the way back down. We gotta start all over. So each level, it gets uh, each height gets a little bit harder because the clouds start moving randomly, start moving in a pattern, you know, start moving differently. And here we go, the final stretch.
Was that a shine spray in the water? Oh my god, Bowser's huge! Oh god! Welcome to the final boss. Now, if you die here, you gotta start all over from the beginning. Oh god. So here's how this level works. You know, it's just it's really hot, very steamy. Everything. You know, Bowser Jr. is gonna be trying to, you know, throw his missiles at us, but all we gotta do. Ground pound! Boom. Break all these things. So we want to make sure we dodge the water. Don't fall in the water. And all we gotta do is... Oh! All we gotta do... All we gotta do is break off all these edges. And this boss... Eh, as long as you don't freaking fall and die, it's not too bad. Because, like, the pieces fall slowly, so you should be good. Also, I... I, I, I want to go that way, Bowser. I do want to go that way. No, I want to go that way. You can just jump over his fire like that. I don't think I've ever jumped over his fire like that before. Also, if you run out of water, I think if you run out of water, you can destroy some of the flying missiles here to get a, like a water bottle and get a water bottle back. I think. But yeah, this level's not too bad. I th this might be. I think this is the easiest. Well, when I was a kid, this was not the easiest boss. But right now yeah i think this is pretty easy and we only got one last one to burn no 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 not like this yeah those missiles if they knock me off i would have been upset and here's where we go the final slam and that's it that's the game our final shine sprite i guess Blood. Oh my god, my robot girlfriend freaking died. Oh my god, no, what is happening? Oh, wait, was I a sister? Yes, you were. Yes, you were. Oh my god, when I was a kid, I did not care, Mario? and I still do not care. It's a robot, it's a machine. All the shine sprites, well not all of them, but the shine sprites have gathered, everybody's at peace, we fulfilled our freaking job to clean up the place, make it brighter, everybody's happier now. Junior, I've got something difficult to tell you about Princess Peach. I know, she's not really my mama. Ah! Uh, oh! Someday, when I'm bigger, I want to fight that Mario again. That's my boy. Well put, son. The Royal Koopa Life is as strong as ever. But for now, let's just rest a while. You're probably wondering, if if Princess Peach is not Bowser Jr.'s mom, then who is? Well, turns out, it's just a theory, though. Bowser Jr. is just Bowser. It's past self. Oh, the toads. They're holding the dead body of my... Oh, no! The She's alive! Oh my god. Oh gosh. Oh. And that's it. That is the game. Another one of the games I played as a kid. And a, and a lot of people's favorite, freaking favorite Mario game. Well, we got a credits. Uh, you know, the pictures are just everybody like having fun without any troubles. Like actually riding a roller coaster in Pina Park and freaking actually sleeping in the hotel instead of dealing with the ghost. All that stuff. Even gambling. But that is the Mario series. There's going to be more 
games I played as a kid coming up soon. I do hope you enjoy watching. I always appreciate you watching. Oh my gosh, Princess Peach, good fish. That's a big one. Always appreciate you watching and have a good one.